What is up, guys, and welcome to another episode of our Foot Draft to Glory series. As you can tell, it has been a while since I recorded a Foot Draft to Glory uh, video on my, my YouTube channel. But that is because I did what I promised I said I would and cleared out my entire club of players, staff, club items are the only ones I'm using, and then consumables, I just have contracts and fitness cards, which I'll get rid of gradually throughout the series. And that brings us to 264,000 coins. Now, I'm going to be honest with you. You can see we have three packs in the store. I recorded another video. I recorded a video, but it, I'm not, I wasn't going to upload on YouTube. I was not going to do that. I entered the draft. I built a sick team. It was a La Liga Serie A hybrid. And then in the first match, I played like absolute garbage. I haven't played FIFA in a while. I haven't played it since I played Foot Champions last weekend. So it's been a week, it's been a solid week and a half since I played FIFA. And I just came out I was it was pitiful. Like I could not have put that on YouTube. So we did go out in the first round of that of that uh foot draft. And I feel bad because it's like I should have I should have done it, but I should have put it on YouTube to keep the series going, but I'm not going to I'm not going to show that footage because it was just horrendous. So we do get have two gold packs and a loan pack. And we'll open those at the end of this video, but we're going to enter another foot draft with 15,000 coins to bring us to a solid 250,000 coins. And we're going to go with I'm going to try a 3 or 4 in the back. Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe I just go four three three holding. I think I'm just gonna do four three three holding. And we're going our captain selection. I think <coughs> I want to take a bombing yang, and that's what we're gonna do because we're gonna get this informed Robin in our next selection. We don't, but we do get an informed bail. So already starting out with pace. No Bundesliga, so we'll take another. We'll take the cheap Neymar Musanda, and Aubameyang may have to be a super sub. We'll have to see. It is looking like it. Actually, we can take a Tiago. Might help. Tehran. Let's take a. Let's take a Tiago, five-star skiller. We might hybrid this up. We get, ooh, we get Conte, who doesn't really help us. De Bruyne, who gets a soft link to Masanda, but Castro gets a strong link to Aubameyang. <coughs> and if we can just get a left wing or a right wing from Bundesliga, Aubameyang will be on full chem. So we'll take our central defensive mid. We do get Sahin, a Bundesliga option. And then we can go ahead and do our defense however we want to. Because everyone else has full chem. But we'll take Hector, the Bundesliga player, because that looks like the best card there. A Bellerine might be a good card. Ooh, this Inform Walker. Except Tiago doesn't have... Or we can just switch them. That's fine. Um, take Walker and switch these guys. And then we just need... Komen would be great at left wing. Or Douglas Costa. That's what we're going to need. We'll take our defense. It might be go BPL into defense. We will see. We'll take a Rudiger. Because he'll get a soft link to Hector. Wow, these defenders are horrid. 
Shaw Cross gets a strong link to um, Walker. So Walker will be on full Kim. And then Joe Hart would be perfect here. Will we get a Joe Hart is the question. We will not. Um, no Germans. Oh, this is frustrating. We'll just take Casillas, Spanish. Could we get a Joe Hart in here? We do get a Joe Hart. We're going to take the Joe Hart. And that gives almost everybody full chem. Actually, it does not. We still have a lot of work to do. But we're getting there. I really want a bom a Yang in this club. So, Pereira doesn't really help us. Wass doesn't really help us. We might take Wass just in case we want to go full La Liga. And I think that's what we're going to do because we're going to take a Ronaldo here. We might end up going full La Liga. If that is the case, Payet doesn't get us anything really. That's a shame. I'm going to take a Sinjo. Just in case we want to go full La Liga. And it gives us a Matthew, which we'll take. Luis Gustavo is a good shout. Take him. But he gives. Okay, yeah. Gonzalo or Castro is not on full cam anymore. Non rares, come on. We get a Bundesliga right back. We also get a French Bundesliga player. Doesn't really help us. We'll take the Bundesliga right back. There's a big player. Javi Martinez may be what we need. Not really, though. Felipe Luis. I don't know what to really do here anymore. I don't really know what I'm doing with this team. We'll take Felipe Luis. We'll take Frank Ribery. There we go. Obama gets full cam. And our only problem is Bales on four. We don't really have. We could get. We could still get that inform Robin. Let's see here. Let's just pick our inform Natovic, Mane. We'll take Mane for super sub. Two more selections. I'm not going to be doing the Kim style glitch anymore. I'm just done doing it. We get Aspas. Who will take? Come on, inform Robin, please. Please inform Robin, please, please, please. <sighs> we don't get it. I do not know what I want to do with this team. I'll be quite honest with you. So that's going to be our team with the manager. We get Bundesliga. Which brings us up to 99. 
96. Six. So yeah, it's gonna be the Bundesliga guy. Um, interesting team, not gonna lie. Interesting team. I think Rudiger and Castro should have gotten some. Yeah, Rudiger's on eight. We're just gonna have to deal with that inform bail and fork him. But sick attack though. Bale, Bamiang, Ribery. Midfield's decent. It's really our defense who just let us down. We got strong super subs. And we're gonna jump into this match. So the first team we would come up against would be a very high rated team. Um, you see Morata, Bale, Neymar, Messi, Benucci, Barzagli, Matuidi, De Gea, just a lot of high-rated players, not a lot of chemistry. You can see Matuidi has no links at all, and I didn't know really what to think of this team, because it is high-rated, but it doesn't have a lot of chemistry. So, we go into the first round, hopefully we do not lose this game. Um... That would be very disappointing if we went out in the first round after I deleted the video of me going out in the first round. But we start off with their kickoff, and I'm feeling pretty confident with the squad I have. I play very well with Aubameyang and Bale. When I have pace, I, I, I do pretty well. So we're going to jump into their first chance here. Um, just poor defending on my part, and Joe Hart makes a makes a good save, and then another good save, punching it out. And yeah, it's just poor poor defending on my part. That's the only weak side of my team was defenders, but here we get a chance with um, Thiago passing it to Aubameyang. We get a lucky bounce off their defender, and Aubameyang puts it in the bomb in the back of the net with his left foot as we go up one nil. Kind of got a lucky bounce off to your missed tackle, but I'll take the goal. And then straight away from their kickoff, um, we almost gave up an equalizer. And that's what I usually have problems with is right after I score a goal, and he just misses really bad with uh, Carrasco, I think. That's my problem. As soon as I score a goal, I, you know, let... And right there, I thought it should have been a pin. Um, that was kind of blatantly a pin, in my opinion. I don't understand how that was not called a pin. But here we have Sahin passing the ball up, and he finds a bomb yang. He brings his keeper out, and I just chip it over him with a bomb yang. That would be a bomb yang second goal of the match. And I'm feeling pretty comfortable at this point going up 2 0 in the 30th minute. But. That's, like I say again, for some reason, after every time I score straight from kickoff, I give him a chance. And he scores his goal right here with Messi. Good finish by Messi. Left foot. Uh, couldn't, re couldn't really do anything about that. It's just, I just hate how I always give up a goal right after I score. I can't seem to defend. And then that's what I would do with this. That would be the end of the first half. Uh, pretty much... Our shots on target were pretty much our goals. No, no really like fantastic saves throughout the game. But starting off the second half, I do a nice bit of passing around in the middle. And he just gives me all this room with Sahin. I was like, I'll go ahead and strike it. And Sahin puts it in the back of the net. And I mean, if you're going to give me all that room, I'm going to fire a shot. And that was just a good strike by Sahin, put it in the top right corner. And I go up 3-1. We have a foul here, and I don't, I don't usually score from these, but somehow Tiago is just wide open, and he gets he gets it with the bottom of his foot to put us up four and one in the 50th minute. Like I said, I don't usually score those, which I was shocked when I when I scored that one. And then he'll get a chance here, just bad bad defending by my part, but a good save by Joe Hart hits off the post. I'm unlucky for him. And then we have Aubameyang just using his pace. And he'll put it in the back of the net. The put us up 5-1. Um, that would secure pretty much the victory for us. 
go ahead and dab on him with Aubameyang. And yeah, from that point, there wasn't really... We had this good stand by Joe Hart. Look at this. Save, one save there. Um, save point-blank range there. And then another one point-blank range there. I mean, Joe Hart like came up huge in this match for me. He had 15 saves, but... I mean, I wasn't really worried about that since we were up 5-1. So we win the first round. Finally, uh, big, big relief on my part of winning the first round, 5-1. And yeah, we'll go ahead and go into the second match. Now our second opponent would have a team like this. Just like the first team, high-rated players, not a lot of chemistry. Lacazette, Ronaldo, Bale, Torre, Pogba. Defense he has five in the back, which I was kind of concerned about because he has a pretty decent defense. With M4 Marcelo, Felipe Luiz, Ruiz, Carvajal, and Danilo. And I'm not going to lie, the first half of this game was very, very boring. I don't think I show any clips from the first half. Yeah, see, there you go. If you saw that, I had one shot on target. He had zero. Very, very boring first half. It almost put me to sleep. But jumping into the second half, he gets a good chance here. He baited me pretty well, and he chipped it over me to Pogba, but Pogba was called offsides. He, I just I just fell for his baits this entire game. He did well draw, trying to draw me in and then um, passing it around to where uh, I just passed it out of bounds right there. But he'll he'll give it out here to Ronaldo and just poor defending on my part, and he just um, pass he just buries me with Ronaldo, and I'm just just poor just poor defending on my part. But we get a counterattack goes here, and then I think we get a chance at the end of this. Looks like we don't. Oh, here we go. Yeah, he just gets it out to Ronaldo. Ronaldo was abusing that right side. And he'll just um, pass it in. And good punch out by Joe Hart right there. And then he gets it back to Yaya Torre. And just another good save by Joe Hart. Or Joe Hart. He honestly should have been up 1-0 at that point. He'll get a corner two. And... Good save again, and then this 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 is why I can't get the ball out of the back. I can't understand, and he'll get another corner, and then this is what I hate about corners in FIFA. All our defenders are in the box, so when I go to clear it out, it just goes straight to that guy right there, and he, he gets a good strike on it, and he almost goes up 1-0. I don't understand why I have to have all our defenders in the box. Here we have a good chance with Bale. I saw his defender going to the far post, so I thought I'd do it near post. And keep it low on the ground. It just it sneaks by the defender, but it just turns out to be wide. I was really upset by that. And then another good chance here. Just couldn't get to head in the back of the net. And then this is why I also hate about corners, man. Why I'm I'm on bounce attack. Why are all our attackers up on the field, leaving two defenders back? Just two missed tackles on my part, and Lacazette's gone, and he's gonna score. He's gonna put this in the back of the net. I hate, hate, hate that about corners, man. I don't understand why all my attackers have to be up front with in the 70th minute. It's not like it's the 90th minute. It's the 70th minute, and you're leaving two defenders back, and and I'm on balanced attacking. And then you see in the bottom right corner, I go to ultra attacking because now I have to score to get this get to get this game tied. And just a bad. Bad passing on my part here, and he just gets it to Ronaldo. Ronaldo's abusing his pace. And I just freaking hate that about corners, man. It's just so frustrating. I was literally screaming at the TV, like, why do I only have two defenders back? And then he'll go off with Ronaldo, and I think this is where he scores his second. He'll just... Or no, he just, just good. He's just used Ronaldo so well. But it was a good save there by Joe Hart, and I was just trying everything I could to get this this equalizer, and I just couldn't find the ball to feet. 
that's my problem in these FIFA matches. I can't, I can't pass the ball to feet, and I end up just ru like right there. I just pass it straight to him, and then I, I need to, I need to make some impact subs here. So I think I bring on Ronaldo for Ribery, and I also bring on Louis Gustavo and Sadio Mane as well, just to add some pace and just try to get this equalizer. Um, yeah, I. Ronaldo, Aubameyang, and Bale, and I couldn't score a goal this match. I don't understand how I did not do that because those are three of the best attackers on FIFA and probably the three best attackers on FIFA in my opinion. But after that boring first half, I just I just couldn't I just couldn't find I just couldn't get a shot on target the entire match. There's a foul on him, and then I do so bad on free kicks. I, just, I literally just pass it short, and he ends up getting the ball and doing a counterattack. I luckily get there with Mane. My apologies, but I thought I edited this, edited this all out. But I'm just showing like my mistakes and how I can improve in FIFA. There's a good tackle there. I'm just trying to push the ball up, but I just can't, man. He just gets he just gets around me. He pushes me off the ball, and now he's sitting here playing it with it in the back, trying to waste time. And then he just good spin or move there by Ronaldo, and he just he knew he was offsides there, so he just fired a shot. I just couldn't get, like I said, I just couldn't get anything going the attacking third this game. There, gets shoved off the ball again. And one of these, he goes down, I think it's this one. He goes, just goes with Ronaldo down the wing. He just passes it short. Another good pass. And then Bale's there, and he finishes it to get put him up 2-0. And I, there's nothing I could do about that. Just both my defenders, Rudiger and Shawcross. Shawcross had low, low pace. Rudiger is not the best defender. Really, my only decent defender was Inform Kyle Walker, and Ronaldo was just eat like eat like eating them for dinner. There you and go. So We're yeah, there out. there's the final the whistle. We go out in the second round. I was pretty disappointed, not gonna lie, but I'm just glad I didn't go out of the first round. 2-0 defeat, and let's go into the packs. I'm not happy with that at all. He only had two shots on target, and they both went in. Prizes are going to be two gold packs and a 7.5k pack. So all in all, four gold packs. Let's see if we get anything out of these. If we do get a rare player. It's going to be a rare silver. We're just going to send all this stuff to the trade pile. Actually, that stuff won't sell. Um, yeah, send that transfer. Quick sell that. Just got to do skip packs on all these gold packs because... And then we're just going to have to send um, the rest of the stuff to the club. Because that stuff is full. Actually, you can... Belgium kit might sell. But this stuff definitely won't. One more regular gold pack. And then we got the jumbo premium gold pack. I guess Seagerson, that's not bad. It'll definitely sell. Um, just quick sell that. And quick sell that. Send the rest to the club. Get this premium low player ward out of the way. Um, quick sell all that. And then 
final pack it's going to be Moya so we will make some So I'll make a little bit of coins, but I'm sorry I'm so bad at FIFA. That's all I can really say. I want to put out good content, but you know, sometimes that just doesn't happen. So leave a like on this video if you want me to keep continuing this series because I don't really know what I want to do. I'm not having fun lo losing in the first and second round all the freaking time. But, you know, stuff happens, so leave a like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.